Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Kyle Devin here, Bullion RV, Duluth, Minnesota. And today we're gonna do a great video of our new Timberwolf. It's a 2023 with 39TN. Uh, it's a destination camper, so if you got that lake lot, uh, seasonal campsite, this would be a great option here for you. So we'll get you on the outside, we'll get you inside. Start up right up front, like we do in all of our videos here. Uh, you're gonna have two 30 pound, I believe. Let me double check. Um, LP tanks, either they're 30 or 20 pounds. Either way, we're gonna film here for you at Bullion uh, before you take off, that's part of the deal. This has a juice pack on the on board, so it comes with a battery and you're gonna have a 100 watt solar panel on the roof to help kind of trickle charge that battery for you. Let's see what these guys are here. Nice, so you got two 30 pounders on board. So we're gonna, like I said, we're gonna fill those here for you. Uh, just a crank, but like I said, you're gonna leave it on a seasonal, so just kind of cranking it up once to level it out. It's not gonna be a big deal here for you. We'll wrap around the back side. You can kind of see the nice front here. Got a couple lights, kind of the cabin-esque look. Um, up front, you're gonna have a really great big pass-through storage. Uh, you got your solar controller on the other side, and then it kind of tucks back for more storage in there. 50 amp service on this rig with your big cord here. Um, kind of keep an eye on these windows as we go. These new year, uh, the new ones are coming out. They kind of have that mirrored look to them, um, almost like that two-way glass. So people can't really see in. So not only are they tinted, but they got that mirrored look to them. So kind of help that privacy factor on that as well. You also are gonna have uh, four stabilizers that are gonna be in all the corners. So drop those down. But these guys you might want to block them out as well because they are just going to sit there. So blocking them out on cinder blocks is probably going to be your best bet for the most stabilization. But a couple extra guys there. All your water hookups are going to be out back here. You got your black tank flush. You got your cable, fresh water, city water. And then you also have a hot and cold shower outside too. It's going to be really nice if you got kids, pets, uh, spraying off some toys, anything like that. Nice little shower outside here. One slide on this box or one slide on this unit. Wrap around the back side. This is where that 50 amp service is gonna be plugged in here for you. You also have another outdoor storage compartment tucked in the back here. So maybe storing a small little Blackstone grill or, you know, tubes, whatever you got going on. Just nice outdoor storage on it. It is, now they are coming with the Lippert ladder prep. So they're kind of throwing a little device up there for a ladder prep that'll just kind of hook in. So you would be able to put a ladder up there if you wanted to buy one or a big, whatever kind of ladder you have. But they have a nice prep up there for you. Leash latch for your best buddy. About a 1500 pound capacity on there. So hook up your dogs, or if you get those kids or your husband that runs away, you can hook them up here, kind of keep them around so they don't wander off in the middle of the day great entertainment space out front so a lot of people like to maybe build a deck out here in front of that sliding glass door so you can get rid of those stairs put a nice deck get this big beautiful awning with all the led strips under there to light it up you got outdoor speakers you got a spot to put a tv you got your cable and the plug-ins right here so a really great entertainment space and like i said putting a deck out front they are coming with your on-demand hot water heater so a tankless hot water heater on this guy that's going to be really nice for you these don't go traveling a lot but if you wanted to leave it they do come with these quick simple little uh, air pressure gauges uh, green means you're good we'll just kind of pop it off here i don't know if you can see it in the video but they'll pop red so if you see that they'll need air but like i said if you're just sitting at a site even if you block it out just something it's just something little and nice that it has it there for you like i said really nice solid steps if you wanted to leave these like i said otherwise these do just pop off and people build a nice little patio deck out front of them with this sliding glass door um, also on this unit you can't really see it in the video but at night they've added these new little logos so it's going to be like the Wolfpack logo uh the forest river logo that just kind of shines and it'll shine on the ground if you ever seen them on like car doors people add them or the lights so it's kind of what it is it's kind of neat um so that's really the outside of it everything else is on the inside we'll swing in there and check it out so we do offer delivery here um otherwise this is a smaller unit that is 
about 8,700 pounds dry weight. So, you know, if you got that big half ton truck or at least a three quarter ton truck, this is something that you could be able to take care of and bring it to your own site, which is kind of nice. Um, nice living space in here, nice and open. You got an electric fireplace, so when you're plugged in, you're gonna have about 5,000 BTU of heat coming out of that guy. Three burner cooktop, a nice oven in here with some good space. Um, and then you got a couple nice storage drawers for pots and pans and cookie sheets and things like that. Good counter space, microwave. You do have the one big basin stainless steel farm style sink with the pull down faucet, plug-ins for, you know, if you're throwing a crock pot, coffee maker, or whatever you got going on, waffle maker, you can do that. Little push puck lights under here for you. Nice windows over the sink as well. Um, what I really like about these destination campers is the really tall ceilings. So you got that fifth wheel feel, tall ceilings. It's really gonna be nice in the bathroom as well. So the showers for you taller folks, you're not gonna be ducking down in the shower. Uh, sleeping in this unit, you have the big U-shaped dinette that'll drop down to a nice sleeper. The couch will pull out to a sleeper. You know, you got huge storage drawers that pull all the way out for all your favorite games, board games, puzzles, anything like that can go in there. Um, nice wall, maybe is something that you could put some of those 3M strips and be able to hang some hoodies or kind of coats or anything maybe on this wall here. Nice place to display some art, I mean, you know. Uh, TV backer with all your appropriate plugins and hookups right there. So a nice spot for a TV right across from the seating area. You can kind of notice some of the blue party lights, the accent lights are gonna be kind of up there. Also on the speakers on the inside, you got some little lights up in there as well. Kind of a fun little feature. Really big cabinets and storage in this unit as well. Got the zebra shades. Forest River's been doing the zebra shades for a few years now. So these are kind of neat. You kind of, if you go too fast, it might be a little weird for you, but um, pull them down, you can black them all the way out. You can kind of adjust them, bring some light in, or again, just go all the way up and bring all the light in. Uh, again, tinted windows so like you can see from the outside, you can see out but with that mirrored style on the outside, it's harder to see in, so. This corner is a little tight, but you got really huge pantry, um, or if you wanted to, it is prepped for a washer dryer in there as well. So great storage area, great pantry. If it's something you want to wash and dryer, you have the capability to do that. Again, back here, you have a really nice refrigerator. A um, couple doors for a freezer. So you got like the his and her drawer or maybe the popsicles and the fresh fish drawer, whatever you got going on. But a double door. Wine rack. Or I don't know what else is gonna fit in there. I think it's just, I think it's just wine. I think that's all it's for. You got eight bottles of wine to fit up there, so. This unit's got a nice little bunk room back in here. So a couple bunks on the top, two bunks on the bottom. You got a nice good storage space under this bunk here. So, you know, I got three dogs myself. I could definitely see at least two out of the three finding their way down there and making that their little home back here with all the kids. That would be a great spot. All the bunks are going to have USB plug-ins. They're all going to have lights. They all have a window, so it's going to feel, you know, you don't have that claustrophobic feel back here. This little section, maybe throw a couple extra devices, kind of tuck it here. If you wanted to put a TV back here, you could. And then you got the appropriate hookups there. This unit is AC ducted throughout the whole unit, so you do have AC ducts here in the, the bunk room. In floor heat as well. Um, and then this, let's, let's see what we got going on here. Well, that's kind of nice. So this looks like it folds out all the way and creates one gigantic bed across the bottom. So that would be great for adults, for the bigger kids. Um, 
that is a cool little feature. So if you guys all want to kind of sleep together, you can do that and make this whole bottom section one big bed. And you still have the two bunks up here or you could do four separate bunks. So it's kind of a nice little add on that tucks away easily and you can turn it into that. So um, it also looks like there's a table that you can plug in back there too. So if you want to play some cards or do some games or have a little lunch section back there, that's kind of nice as well. We'll swing up the front, up into the bathroom. Um, like again, the tall ceilings in here, so plenty of room in the shower. You gotta pour some toilet in the shower or in the bathroom, so for easy cleaning, really has that residential feel. You got the huge sink, you can fit both your hands in here. Max air fan in the bathroom, so you actually have a real fan in the bathroom to eliminate air. That does have a rain sensor on it as well, so if anybody were to leave it open, story goes, it rains, that will shut on you automatically, so that can be great. Shower's huge, like I said, all the tall space. And if it's one of those long days you need to sit down, you got that spot in the shower as well. Move up in here to the bedroom. Again, with the with the 50 amp service, you got an AC unit out there. You also have an AC unit now here in the bedroom. So keep this room nice and cool for you. A lot of great storage. So you got the we like to call it the hers and hers, but with this unit, you have a section over here. So us guys, we actually might get a spot to put a couple clothes. I know we don't travel with a lot of clothes, you know, maybe a couple shorts, t-shirt, swim shirt, swim shorts, sweatshirt, hoodie, call it good. Um, but have the capability to maybe do it. Power and USB on both sides of the bed, little cubbies. So if you do have like a CPAP machine or something like that, you do have little cubbies and things to tuck it away push puck lights above the bed for reading. Um, and then all the, the heat is coming up off the wall in the bedroom here, so no floor ducts in this space. Um, and that's got its own thermostat back here running the AC. And then you have, again, another huge window so you can get some cross ventilation in this as well. So if you just want some fresh air, you can open up the windows if it's a nice night. So. But that is kind of all we have on this unit here. Again, my name is Kyle Dittman. I'm here with Bullion RV in Duluth, Minnesota. If you haven't already, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. We've got the jets flying over us right now. So the air show is coming up here in July. Come down and check us out. They're right across the street. You can kind of kill two birds with one stone. Give us a call. Let us know how we can help. My number 218-740-4964. Thanks. Have a great day.